a Chinese protester beaten in Manchester, the 20th Party Congress, and who was responsible for what happened to who. After the protests ended in 2019, the flame of democracy in Hong Kong did not die, especially because it was kept alive by many people in foreign countries still protesting freely. The biggest of these was the UK. Many people in the UK from Hong Kong saw it as a bit disrespectful that the UK spent so much effort into Hong Kong. And then, when China basically ignored Article 27 in the Hong Kong Basic Law, protesters took to the streets to take it into their own hands. So it's a bit hard to see what's going on, but I'll basically narrate. So, the diplomat in the M Manchester Embassy to China, basically, as Hong Kong protesters are out protesting, uh, the diplomat comes out and begins tearing down the signs. Then as he walks back in, he takes a protester with him. Then he and his pals in the embassy begin beating him up. A police officer then goes in to retrieve him. However, according to Chinese state media, the protesters were invading the embassy, whatever that's supposed to mean, and so the people in there decided to defend themselves. Not much more to say, apparently that ambassador is going to be recalled back to China soon, and an investigation is going on, but other than that, not much else to say. Well, in China, everyone's been glued to their TVs. What happened? Did a new movie come out? A ripoff one at that. Or what happened? Well, the 20th Party Congress happened. It's basically where all the top elites from the Chinese Communist Party come together once a year to decide the next president, or if the current one will be serving another term, and to discuss some other big things, like zero COVID. Now, all across the country, whether you're in a wedding, or a big event, or the opening of a special building, everywhere in China, people were glued to the 20th Party Congress. Even if you were a Uyghur in a concentration camp. Nope, you're watching the 20th Party Congress. Anyways, you guys are probably all screaming for me to talk about it. So I'll talk about something else to save more time and to drag out this video. So the basic rundown from the 20th Party Congress is China's president, Xi Jinping, applauded himself on how well zero COVID is going. I don't know so much about that. And also he won a third term, no surprise. Anyways, calm down, I'll talk about what you guys all want me to talk about. Hu Jintao, what happened to who? Who did that to who? Who? Anyways, basically, while the 20th Party Congress was ongoing and the foreign journalists had begun filming, two security guards entered the room and had a little chat with Xi Jinping. Afterwards, Hu Jintao, who had been trying to get his hands on a specific folder, was led out of the Party Congress. No one knows why this is happening, although a lot suspect it is a purge. However, it should be noted that this seems like a decision made by Xi Jinping on the spot because he had to talk with the security guards. It doesn't seem like a purge then because this wasn't planned. This was just something she wanted. Anyways, Hu Jintao has not publicly appeared since this event. Still, no one knows what happened, but the official Chinese state media explanation is that Hu Jintao was feeling bad, and so they had to escort him out. Indeed, Hu Jintao's health has been deteriorating rapidly, and he has aged rather fast. Anyways, in the coming days, it'll be seen what happens. Anyways, Hong Kong itself is being pretty silent right now, but Zoe Gein, and see you in the next episode.